Vada's Chester Chest has been an industry standard in the teaching of central line care since Vada's start in 1987. Available in both light and dark pigments, Chester Chest enables physicians, nurses, and patients to develop competence with the most common types of vascular access devices. This realistic model makes learning to palpate and access implanted ports simple and straightforward, as well as the ability to practice infusion, withdrawal, securement, and dressings of multiple vascular access lines. Vada's Chester Chest model has everything needed for training and a quick and easy setup. Chester Chest is easy to use and assemble. To set up, remove the simulated blood reservoir bag from the back side of the torso. Carefully remove the white cap on the simulated reservoir bag, taking care not to let the liquid leak out. And attach the female lure fitting to the male lure fitting on the bottom of the three-way parallel tube set. Next, replace the reservoir bag behind the white retention strap, making sure that the tubing attached to the bag is positioned exiting the bag from the bottom. To prime the tubing with simulated blood, attach a syringe to the tunneled central venous catheter and draw back to remove all the air in the line. Be sure the snap clamp is open on the catheter. You are ready when simulated blood is visible in the syringe. Next, remove the chest tissue flap on the left side of the chest. Attach a Huber needle to a syringe and access the port. Repeat the procedure used to prime the tunneled central venous catheter until simulated blood is visible in the syringe. The torso is now ready for use. Chester chest can be used to simulate accessing normal, tipping, wandering, or deeply placed IVAD placements in the left chest area. Fluid can be infused and blood withdrawn from all lines. To simulate a wandering port, place lubricating gel beneath the port until the port slides around freely. To perform an access on the port, lay the chester in a supine position and using a Huber needle, access the port through the skin flap. Proper placement is confirmed by a blood return. To use the arm, begin by priming the arm tube. First, attach injection caps or access devices to the IV catheters and dual lumen pick before attaching the simulated blood reservoir bag. Next, open all snap clamps on the back side of the arm and attach a syringe to the peripheral IV and each side of the dual lumen pick. Withdraw air until simulated blood is visible in the syringe. The arm is now ready for use. Blood can be withdrawn and fluid infused from each line, as well as practicing the performing of dressing changes on the pick line or peripheral IV site. With repeated use, the chest tissue flap may need to be cleaned. To best perform this, use a clean towel and either warm, soapy water or isopropyl alcohol. Wipe the pad until clean and allow to fully dry. Sprinkle cornstarch baby talc onto the flap and using a clean, dry cloth, wipe off any excess. One of Chester Chest's best qualities is that it lasts. Vada offers a refurbishing service to restore your chest or chest to a like new condition at a significantly reduced rate compared to a new model. Customers can send in their old chest or chest models and have them cleaned, updated, and refurbished. There is also an optional carrying case for storing or transporting your chest or chest. To learn more or purchase, click the link below.